Good morning, Twitch.tv. Good morning to YouTube as well. And of course, good morning, Mini Metro. Oh boy, it was it was a tight one this morning, folks. We almost, almost uh, had to switch over to something else in order to get today's Mini Metro going. Let's go into today's daily challenge. We are going to Stockholm on normal. And of course, as you can tell already, we are in the full screen experience today. Folks on Twitch getting a taste of what everyone on YouTube already knows, and that is on Fridays. I frankly don't feel like turning on my webcam, and we don't have the live chat or anything. So we go with a full screen mini metro experience. And we're going to do that today because Streamlabs is uh, crap in the bed, basically. I don't know what to tell you. Oh, God. Okay, um, let's move the blue line up here, and we'll send the red line down here, and we will be very thankful that we are on normal and not extreme. Oh, boy. Okay. All right, let's get this mic a little closer to my mouth. Maybe turn it up a little bit. There we go. Okay. Uh, we can run the blue line down here, pick up this circle. Stockholm is, a, Stockholm is a map that I like the look of, but I find that very often it is, uh, it is not the friendliest place. We'll run a green line out to this circle. That'll be just fine. We're already doing all three of our lines. So yes, uh, Streamlabs not playing nicely. Probably a side effect of the fact that Twitch and Amazon and Reddit were down until 90 seconds before I was going to start my stream on YouTube. Uh, let's go ahead and take a locomotive. I will take two more tunnels for long-term sustainability. Uh, Jer actually thinks he got his highest passenger count so far when he did the daily challenge today. That's nice. Uh, you know, the first time you play each map is just about learning, like, what it looks like. Good morning, Tube Lima. Good to see you. Hope you are doing well. Don't know what it is like for you on the other side of the pond, but uh, here in the U.S., we are just, just, just getting over a Twitch downage. So downage twitch outage so we are going with the full screen experience today it means i can turn off my light oh my god it is so hot it is so hot y'all it is hot I might go full screen phoenix right today just to t keep the light off oh we'll see we will see but yes later tonight let me get my plug in now nice and early uh phoenix right ace attorney continues tonight here on well, hopefully here on Twitch. We'll see. Let's let's say here on Twitch. Yeah, here on Twitch, definitely. Uh, Blue Line's going to pick up that there. Very helpful triangle. Uh, we will take a locomotive, and I'm good on tunnels for now. We'll take a carriage. I will even give that carriage to the Blue Line. And now the Blue Line should be just fine. And yes, again, that was a very helpful triangle. <laughs> Twitch knew that I needed to do Good Morning Mini Metro. Oh, to have that kind of power, Ghosty. Uh, I was going to say let's draw another line here, but I don't have another line to draw. So, uh, I suppose we'll give this to the green line, toss another locomotive on that. That sounds like a plan. Uh, it has indeed been a couple of weeks since we did Phoenix Wright here on the channel. I was, uh, I was a bit under the weather last Tuesday, so we didn't do that. Weren't we talking about how bad Berlin is yesterday? I mean, probably. Like, I would not say Berlin is a bad map in the sense that it is poorly designed or anything, but Berlin is definitely a difficult and frustrating experience most of the time. All right, this, this little back end of the green line needs to get chopped off sooner rather than later. We can also do this. Uh, bring this out here, make sure that our uniques don't start piling up. I'll take a locomotive and give me another line. And I was just talking about how we needed to do this, so let's do that. We'll get a brown line going. It's rare, kind of rare for me, that, um, that we see a triangle spawn up here in the north, so I'm pretty happy. Uh, I'm going to wait until after the daily to story time. Okay. That's right, Jer has a story for us. All right, blue line is looking pretty good. Started off a little dicey with the two circles and the uniques, but it's looking all right. The red line, hey, I was just gonna say, 
that the red line had these two circles in a row at the end of it, and that might be a problem, but it looks like it's okay now. We can even take the red line here. Can you turn this and be okay? Yes, you can. Great. Why don't you go ahead and do that? All right. So the green line's looking pretty okay. Uh, red line's going to grab this unique. It'll probably need another locomotive soon. Uh, actually, pretty much now, but hey, it's Sunday. Let's take a locomotive and an interchange, and we'll slap that interchange down here on our central square. And I will, in fact, put the other locomotive on the red line. Uh, unique for the green line. Just tells me that eventually I'm going to want to... Uh, well, the green line already has another locomotive on it, so it should be fine. Uh, triangle up here. For now, we can do this. I don't love that, but it uh, needs doing. This circle up here is a pain in the butt. Um, can I? No. Um, interesting. Let's do this and then swirl you around like so. Well, I hate that, but you know what? It's going to have to work, at least for now. I could take the brown line and hook it around, but I think... I think in general it'll be better if I just, you know, get through this week and then get another line and chop this and this off of the green line. It'll be fine. Circle up there. We'll curve and reroute the brown line. That's going to be just fine. We're through another week. Locomotive and give me a line. Thank you. Let's pause. Clean this up a little bit. Um, keeping this triangle on the green line is probably fine. Like, if I do this, you know, the teal line might drop some uniques right here, and this could become a bit of a choke point, but at least for right now, I think it's going to be okay. Uh, circle down here, we will give to the red line. The red line will continue being okay under penalty of death. Uh, brown line can pick up that second circle, and I'll have to keep an eye on that now. But it looks like everybody's moving pretty smoothly. Yeah. You know, I, I don't really... I thought about taking that carriage off of the blue line and giving it to the brown line. Don't think we're in a position to do that just yet. Uh, triangle here is going to use up our last tunnel, but hey, we've got... We've got stations on each of these three islands, and there are two triangles over here. Usually Stockholm is a lot meaner than that, so we could be putting up a decent score today. Fingers crossed. Of course, as soon as I say that, things start overloading, so we could kind of use a carriage this week, just for that brown line. Let's grab you, run you through here, we'll take a locomotive, and ooh! Do I want a carriage more than I want a line? I think I do. I don't need a line this week. Yeah, no, we're going to take the carriage. Uh, we're definitely going to put the carriage on the brown line. I might put the other locomotive there, too. Uh, yeah, let's do that. I'm going to put the other locomotive on the brown line. It's going to be okay. Blue line might be a little upset at me for a minute, but it's going to be fine. This station looks like it's in trouble, but it's going to get cleared out. You're mostly going to be okay. Ooh. Okay, so this had been a circle, and now it's a star. Which is kind of annoying. But I think it's going to be fine. Yeah, we should be okay here. Red line pulling itself together nicely. Ooh, circle there is annoying. Let's pause. Might be worth trying to redraw this brown line. See if we can. Okay, can you go like so? And then over to here. Can you turn? Nope, you can't do that. Okay. Interesting. That's a problem. I don't like that. How are we going to fix it? I mean, what I could. I don't think I have the tunnels to do this. No dip down there, that's okay, but you'd have to, yeah, you'd have to create 
that creates two acute angles. That's still two. If we do this, that only creates the one. I don't love it, but I think that's the best we're going to do right now. Because I don't have any more tunnels to run. It's not like I have another line to draw. We're just going to have to be okay with that acute angle being right there. And the rest we'll live with. Now, you are totally loaded up. I'm actually going to turn... No, not this one. I'm going to turn this locomotive around once it hits the central square. And have it clean you out completely. That's going to be okay. Red line is getting a little dicey. Uh, just in time for a triangle that is uh, the opposite of helpful to show up. What am I going to do about you? Uh, well, you are going to hit the central square and then come rescue this station. You... Oh, you can do that and still be rounded? I think I'm okay with that. I think I'm very okay with that. Good morning, MV! Can I bring you around here? No, now I'm getting too fancy. Good morning, MV. And Ducklin is here as well. Good morning, Ducklin. Let's get an exclamation point Ducklin in the chat. I think it's Ducklin. Yeah, there we go. Ducklin is doing a subathon later this week. This Friday, in fact. All right. Let's take a locomotive here. Uh, I'm going to take a carriage because I'm a little worried about the state of, well, everything. Uh, the red line is kind of piling up. I'm going to put a carriage on that. Uh, you there are... Oh, boy. Oh, God. This brown line. This brown line is an issue. Um, what are we going to do about this now? So we got this nonsense... I guess we can just... Yeah, we can we can curve that around. Okay. I'm not entirely sure how that works. But uh, we'll do that. Let's put another locomotive on the brown line to take care of this circle station right here. Hopefully that'll be okay. All right. You are going to pull into the central square. And you know what? Just drop everything right there. It's going to have to be okay. Forgot to mute my phone before I started the stream. So if you heard that, I apologize. All right. How's the red line doing? Kind of sort of falling apart. Uh, how's the green line doing? Pretty much fine. You can grab that circle. Uh, you come in here. You clear out a lot of those uniques. That's helpful. Grab that triangle. That's fine. You just have circles. So why don't you drop them there and then come save this? And that'll be okay. We'll get you cleaned up there. All right. We are at quarter after seven, which is fine. God, I want to chop this red line in half so bad. I can't do it this coming week. I might be able to do it next week if everything works out perfectly, but I really want to chop this red line right now. Um, this is going to have to be an acute angle somewhere. Fuck. Suppose I could redraw the blue line a little bit to help out? Now, granted, that would make the blue line a million miles long, but... Then the blue line might have to be a million miles long. All right. Uh, speaking of blue lines, let's have our tealy line come up here. Oh, you're going to have to be acute there because you don't want to curve over for that. Okay, that makes sense. I mean, it's annoying, but it makes sense. All right. You drop there, and then you come here and save that station before everything goes to hell. We're fine. I will take a locomotive. I kind of want these two tunnels to be honest but i feel like the carriage is the survivalist option and survival is more important than aesthetics so here's a carriage now let me look at this i could probably redraw the red line such that hold on i'm gonna do something stupid here hold on Let's take you and go like this. Now, granted, here are some obvious problems with my setup here. One, four consecutive circles in the middle here. Two, I've got a unique all the way at the end. Three, 
The red line was teetering on the brink of collapse, and now I have no idea where any of its locomotives are going. Four. Actually, there might just be three obvious problems. But that's still three obvious problems, which is a lot of obvious problems. Anyway, we're going to leave that alone. It's going to be fine. Uh, let's put this carriage on the green line to clear up this nonsense. And we've got a brown line train that is kind of on fire. Uh, I don't want to give that the locomotive. Here's what I'm going to do. We're going to start. You're going to hit the central square, and then you're going to come rescue this. Okay? So you do that. That's going to be totally fine. The triangles get cleared out. The squares get cleared out. Everybody's happy. Uh, I said everybody's happy, green line. Didn't you hear me? Everybody's not happy. Okay, fine. Uh, the red line can have this guy going this way. The red line's not on fire. It's just smoldering a little bit because I recently put out a fire. It's fine. It's fine. The red line's catching up. And we can get triangles taken in both directions. That's okay. It could be a lot worse. Listen, you hit the wedge and then come here because you're going to clear out this, 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 and this all going in this direction. It's all going to be 100% fine. Well, it's going to be at least 5% fine. Uh, circle there. I have one locomotive on the teal line. I'm going to have to give that to the green line. I don't like giving it to the green line, but, you know, we do what we got to do here. Okay, uh, plus signs are starting to pile up at the central square. They're on the green line. Green line's coming in. That's going to be okay. Uh, red line's going out. That's going to be okay. This station stops being on fire. This station is still kind of on fire. We'll have a locomotive. Uh, give me another line. I'll figure it out. With time, I can figure it out. Okay. Uh, do I chop the green line? No. Right now... Yeah, unfortunately, right now, this line is not terribly useful to me. That was a long-term investment. Short-term investment is locomotive on the, on the red line. Okay, uh, so this brown guy with the carriage is going to pull through into the circle. You jump all the way ahead. Uh, Ghosty capped off at 1600. We are past that. Uh, let's see. Uh, you, uh, you're going to make it to there, I think. But I only think. You've just got plus signs. Whatever this is, it's helpful. Whatever this is, it's going to be helpful because it's going to let me do that, which rounds this corner. So I love this station no matter what it is. Uh, you, why don't you start it, start on this station? Because this guy right here is going to run through and save that. That's a circle. That's fine. Go. See? You run through and save that. You're fine. We're all fine. Did I mention that I added some piano mixes of video game songs to my Good Morning Mini Metro playlist? Let me know what you think. Also, uh, YouTube, let me know what you think. Can I get away with playing these songs? I hope so. I got sick of you throwing me copyright violations for every lo-fi Final Fantasy VII mix. Okay, uh, this blue line is sort of on fire. And by sort of on fire, I mean fucking burning. Uh, uh, triangle there is actually pretty helpful. You know what? Let's terminate both of these lines there, and that's going to have to be just fine. Where did my other green line train go? I put it ahead of this one, so hopefully it is ahead of that one. Oh, it just grabbed a bunch of plus signs. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Okay. Um, interesting. Interesting. Okay. So... If I pull this now, it's going to drop all of those plus signs right here, creating a problem for future green line. But a problem for future green line is better than a problem for present green line. So my alternative is actually, hold on. Uh, no, that'll, that'll murder the brown line. Uh, this won't murder the brown line, though. If I do that and I pull this here. Okay, go. Uh, all right. You hit that circle, but actually come rescue this circle. That's going to be fine. That's fine. This is not fine. This is not fine. Uh, you 
are gonna drop all of those circles right there, turn around here, that's gonna be fine. We're fine for a moment because this gets cleared out, that gets cleared out, that got cleared out, everything's fine. I think we can make it another week. Okay, triangle there is annoying, actually. Um, hmm, can I pull it onto this? Not delicately, but if I do this, I can make it longer but more delicate. Like Victorian lovemaking. I guess. I don't know where I was going with that. Let's just hit the space bar and keep going. All right, you go there. Uh, you're gonna hit that triangle and then rescue all of this. That's okay. Uh, you are mostly fine, I guess? Sure, you're mostly fine, I guess. Uh, you've got a whole bunch of uniques, which is an issue. Uh, circle there pretty much has to go on the red line. Okay, uh, you've got a whole... You know what, just drop your pentagons and then turn around. That diamond can languish for a while. It'll be okay. Alright, um... Brown line, brown line, brown line, brown line, brown line. Look, you're fine. You're gonna drop your triangles right there, and then come rescue this. Uh, this guy here is gonna pull all of these into there and then I think having it rescue this station is the best plan I've got oh boy 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 go okay all right blue line's fine uh teal line is not fine we'll take a locomotive I have a spare line I wanted bridges I don't have them give me a carriage okay uh what do I do with this carriage uh, I think the obvious answer is I put it on the teal line. Now, what do I do with the locomotive? I wait for the next thing to catch fire that I can't save. Uh, Googie, do you have any advice for us boobs? I support yourselves well to prevent sagging. <laughs> um, you know. I'm sorry, Douglas. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, God, I cracked myself up. Okay, um... What am I doing? <laughs> I deserved that. Half regular mammograms. <laughs> oh God. Okay. All right, uh, circle there is gonna have to go on the green line for lack of a better option. This locomotive here is about to dump everything in the world at the central square. And the problem is the central square is already overloaded with stars, which are supposed to go on the brown line. Basically what I'm saying is the brown line is fucked. It's fine. Okay, uh, you hit that and then come out here, rescue this. That's gonna be fine. Because this gets rescued. Okay, oh, look at, look at how on fire the teal line is. Oh boy, oh, do we have anything to save that? Um, thoughts and prayers for the teal line. You're gonna drop your triangles there and then just just go this way and hope it all works out. Okay. Um, you've got a whole bunch of triangles. Why don't you drop them there and then come rescue this guy? Here we go. Okay. We're starting to get somewhere. Uh, you drop your triangles there and come through here to rescue this. That's okay. That's fine. We're doing it. You're going to hit the central square. Oh. Oh, that's on fire right now. Um, interesting. What can get there the fastest? This guy. The only re the only chance I have of saving this is pulling this, drop the plus sign, and get here before that circle station dies. I don't think that's going to happen, but let's see if it does. You were pulled into the station. God. Oh, fine. Whatever. Okay. So, 2,782 passengers over 73 days. I feel pretty good about that. I feel like that's a good score. Let's see. Let's just take a look here, see what we've got. Top 10%. I will take that. What the? Mount Bay Safer. What the? You're not even subtle, my guy. Like, what you could do is check the leaderboards beforehand and say, oh, Nelson's at 5,300? Okay, 
I'll, you know, I'll, I'll let myself stall out around, say, 6,000. But no, 28,132. Sure, I, I'm, I'm sure that's legit. Mount Bay safer. Totally safe. Totally legit. Anyway, 2,782. I will totally take that. Hey, Jer, Jer almost broke 1,000. That's a pretty good score for your first time playing Stockholm. That's great. All right, let's do one more. You know what we'll do? Uh, Ducklin was asking for, for tips just kind of for noobs. So let's go to a map that I love. A pretty simple map. Let's go to New York City. And I'll just kind of talk through my entire thought process here. So your basic line structure, you want to have... Uh, you want to have one of each of your basic stations on every line, or at least as many lines as you can. And the basics are circles, triangles, and squares. And uh, yeah, as as people are saying, you can check your you can check your friends' all time stats on levels too, uh, not just the um, not just the daily challenge. We'll do that, uh, if I remember to do that, we'll do that after we finish New York City here. But yeah, you can. Uh, there's just a tab to pop back and forth to check your friend's score on the Daily Challenge as well. So, uh, what I'm doing on New York City here is what I usually like to do. I usually have a loop on Manhattan, you know, this island here. And then I have other lines going out through here. Now, this red line is going to run into an issue because it's got one, two, three consecutive circle stations before, you know, with triangles on either end. So eventually, the triangles are going to overload that locomotive. Uh, I will take another locomotive and another line, and I'm just going to draw a purple line to go get that triangle. See, it's got three here, and then there's one, and it's full. And fortunately, these got cleared out. But the next time it goes around, it might not be so lucky, right? So it's going to drop that circle there, pick up these three, pick up that. And now, again, it's just, it's just hanging on. And it's already like, this is super early. Less than 100 passengers delivered. And already that locomotive is right on the end. And you can see here... Like, this also has three consecutive circles, but these three are at the end of the line as opposed to in the middle of the line. Like, in the middle of the line with triangles on either end, you know, the triangles all get cleared out here. It's not a big deal. But here, there's nothing out here for them to clear out. So you see this station, just one time through, is already being left alone. So what I'm going to do is two things. One... I'm going to chop that in half because I just realized uh, I have a, yeah, we've got a triangle down here, so I'm going to do that, and two, I've got another blue line, so I'm going to draw that out there, use my last bridge. Okay, that should be a little better. Is there a middle in a loop? Um, I mean, I guess it would be where the tie point is, and let me take a locomotive, and I will go for another line. We're going to bring the red line up there. And now now that there's four consecutive circles, you know, there's one, two, three, four, five, six passengers, this guy's totally full. So we just ran right through that station. So what I'm going to do while we're talking here is just put another locomotive on the red line. So I am also curious about... Um, I am also curious about what Ghosty is talking about in the comments as well, so in, in the chat rather, so I will be paying attention to that while I finish answering Duckland's question. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. There we go. So, like, obviously, you know, it's a loop. It's basically, you know, if you think of it as a circle, there's no quote-unquote middle, but what the game does... Ooh, triangle there is nice and helpful. Uh, you've got this little tie right here. And every line has them. They're just right at the end of the line. You know, the green lines is right here and right here at either end. But because the red line is a loop, it only has the one. So if I want to disconnect, like if I want to take the red line and just make it less of a loop, uh, we'll take a locomotive and I will have two more bridges because I have no bridges. What I could do is take this tie off of, the, off of that square and bring it up 
or bring it down. Okay, so it only wants to go in one direction right now. Okay. Uh, listen, buddy. Why don't you hit that triangle? Go out there and do all of that. That'll be fine. Uh, and the green line will go get that. Okay, you do all of that. So if you want to just... If you want to just unloop one of the stations, it's not a big deal. Like, I can just take this circle off, no problem. But if I wanted to make this not a loop, I would have to uh, separate it right at the tie. Now let me catch up on this. Uh, a, they apparently use outside cheat engines like something called Poke. Okay, that makes sense. B, a self-professed cheater, apologized, said he wasn't trying to get on the leaderboard. He was trying to build the best metro possible and see what was most efficient. I mean, that seems like it would be a decent excuse. Uh, stop, don't play the fucking daily challenge with your cheat program open, my guy. And C, people are really fucking pissed about mini metro cheating. I believe that. I absolutely believe that. Like... I was about to say I don't consider myself a hardcore mini metro player, and then I remembered that I play mini metro on the internet literally five times a week, and also recreationally, so I'm probably a bit of a hardcore mini metro player. All that having been said, I am pretty fucking pissed about mini metro cheating, and I just just from the daily challenge scores that I've seen, I believe Mount Bay Safer should be banned from playing mini metro somehow. Anyway, <laughs> so the answer is that yes, the people with the ridiculous scores are in fact cheating, there is no legitimate way to do this, and people hate this. That's... okay. <laughs> okay, well, I, I, I believe all of that. Okay, what are we going to do here about this green line? This is... yeah, this situation right here is a bit of an issue. Let me give just a little bit more of that. Uh, triangle there is going to be helpful for the red line to break up all of this consecutive nonsense. Um, consecutive nonsense would be a decent name for a podcast. Uh, let's slip C here. Uh, go locomotive, and I'll take an interchange. Ducklin, are you taking the dream excuse? Oh, God, who's the dream of Mini Metro? Oh no. Oh, I didn't I didn't need to think about that. We don't need to know any of that. No. Oh god, why did I why did I let that thought enter the universe? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh let's chop this green line in half. Let, let, let's get on to more pleasant matters, such as chopping the green line in half. We're just gonna do that. That's gonna be okay. If we chop the green line in half, everything will be fine. Uh, let's make an orange line do most of the things the green line had been doing, such as going this way, and going that way, and doing that. Now, can you come up and hit that triangle and turn out that way? Sure. Great. Do that. Okay, now. Ooh, it is story time from Jer. Last night at about 8.30, his bed literally broke in half. Oh, I have had that happen, and it is not fun. Uh, oh, oh boy. What, what are we going to do about this circle? Um, actually, hold on. Uh, green one, let me borrow you. Come this way. Down the middle where you normally lay, totally making it impossible to sleep unless you sleep in the living room. That's awful. Oh, that sounds like a very bad thing to have happened to Jer. I'm sorry. Also, uh, the red line is doomed. Yeah, the red line appears doomed. Um, how am I going to solve that? Uh, let's grab you and toss you there and hope that you can save this. Can you save that? No, you can't save that. Um, well, this is a problem, y'all. Uh, the purple line can pitch in. Uh oh, actually, no, the red line is full of locomotives already. Uh, you can jump forward, but that's not going to clear you there we go oh i still i still have my yellow line i don't have a locomotive for it but i suppose i could draw it and then transfer a locomotive i should have done that oh are you gonna be safe are you gonna be safe okay you're safe okay we're alive we live it 
Problem is, uh, no, I did not actually rob all of the locomotives off of the purple line. Okay, all right. Orange line is in this. We are in with a plan. Okay. So the red line has all of the locomotives it can have, but it's okay. Uh, listen, you only just now caught fire. This one's been on fire, so it's more important. You hit that and then come rescue this. Why is this so much of a dilemma? I was going to use this as a tutorial level, dang it. Why are you on fire, New York? <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, you're just loaded with squares. Okay. Um, there we go. Okay. So that diamond, those diamonds rather, are going to go all the way out there. You're going to be just fine. You're going to hit that and then come rescue this station and it's going to be fine. I order it to be fine. Uh, you're going to hit the central square and then come rescue this station and I order it to be fine. I don't know if it's actually going to be fine this time. It's fine. Kinda. Kinda. You're going to hit the central square and come rescue this station and it's going to be actually fine this time. Right? Yes! It's actually fine. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. You're going to hit the central square and rescue this station and it's going to be fine. How many times can I do that? You're going to hit the central square and rescue... Uh, actually, you need to go out this way to rescue this station and that's going to be fine. Okay. You're going to rescue this. See, that's... You're loading passengers! I'm mad. Oh, God. Okay. Well, fine. Listen. We got we got far enough. All right, let me look at the stats here. Zoom. So this is like... I never show this off, but you've got, you know, charts of each... You know, you've got charts of your lines. There are total trips over time. Uh, there were angry passengers. See, nobody's angry. Nobody's angry. People are a little bit angry. People are a little bit angry. Nobody's angry. Everybody's angry. Oh my god, they're angry. And we're dead. Just like that. Uh, you can turn on your population if you want. Uh, you can chart the number of stations that were on the map. It always goes up. The track length. Trip distance. This is... Man. This is all cool. I never look at this, this chart, but... Transfers for trip it, per trip, it even charts that. Uh, it went up. That's bad. Uh, total capacity looks like you can only have three graphs displayed at once, which makes sense. You don't want you know 14. Well, some people might want 14 lines here. So yeah, total capacity versus used capacity. If used capacity exceeds total capacity, you got a problem. That's uh, scientific analysis right there. If there are more people using your thing than you can handle, you have an issue. I wasn't even trying to find that, so that is cool. Back out here in the menu, you've got this button right here is the all-time stats. So right now I can see my where my high score on New York City, 2267, ranks among all players, top 5% all-time, uh, and also among my Steam friends. So I'm just below Parlor Ghost, but my high score is better than Bog Unicorns, it's better than Jairs, it's better than Nude Indigos, and it's better than Nut Bunnies. Is, is, is. And if I hit this button right here, it flips to all time. So the all time top scores in New York City are, it looks like 10 people who cheated, to be honest. <laughs> so I, I don't know how you do it, but anyway. But yeah, you can compare among your friends. And hey, now we have a, a tangible goal here. We can try to beat Ghosties 2379, which we did not do today because New York City was mean to us. But yeah, that is going to do it for today's episode of Good Morning Mini Metro. God, there are six of y'all watching right now. Really good numbers for Good Morning Mini Metro. I really appreciate everybody who came out and watched. Let me see if we've got anybody. Nobody I follow is streaming right now with less than like 500 viewers. So let's not do that. Uh, is anyone else playing Mini Metro on Twitch right now for us to say hi to? Of course not. All right, let's go watch the let's go watch the otters then. We're gonna raid Marine Mammal Rescue. Go watch some chill otters. 
they're going to be nice and cool. I'm going to turn on my air conditioning and be nice and cool. Folks watching on YouTube, thank you so much for being here. Starlight came in right at the end. But you know what? Starlight, you can come back tonight at 6 o'clock Eastern if you want, because I will be continuing Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney. In the meantime, everybody go watch some otters. Say hi. Tell them it's a goo grade. Yes, it is. They won't know what it means because they're otters, but, you know, the point is there. Folks watching on YouTube, I hope you have a wonderful day as well, and I will talk to you next time. Goodbye. Goodbye.